Welcome to this Operations Bridge video tutorial. In this video, you will learn how to use performance dashboards to analyze system performance over time. Start by going to the Performance Perspective workspace, where you select a view that contains the configuration items that you want to work with. Each type of CI can have its own dashboards. This is the default dashboard for Oracle, which is different from the dashboard for SQL Server. Let's focus on this Unix node to look for potential bottlenecks. And select a different dashboard from the default. The Sample System Key Performance Indicators dashboard is a good starting point. It consists of three charts of data for the last six hours. Let's check the performance over the past week. To do that, click the Date Range panel where you can adjust the date range via the slider or choose a custom range from the calendar or in this case select a preset time frame of last 7 days. Toggle the date range panel to hide the date range again to save screen space. There are regular CPU spikes at 2 o'clock each weekday. Let's zoom in on one of them by dragging the mouse from left to right across the chart for the time frame of interest. You can zoom in again to further refine the time frame. Let's find out which processes are responsible for this spike. Select the Process drill down dashboard. It shows the processes for this CI that occurred in the spike time window. Let's sort the list by CPU. The DD process is the one that's consuming most of our CPU here. You can also filter the list. To look for processes consuming more than one gigabyte of memory, enter the greater than symbol followed by one million in the res mem column and click filter. Sort the column for the highest memory using processes. Click clear filter to clear the filter. Let's look at the performance on another Unix system. You may get this pop-up about unsaved changes because we interacted in the dashboard. Just click Cancel to continue. Note the time frame is the same zoomed in time window. This is useful when analyzing different systems in the same time frame, but in this case, let's choose the last seven days again. You can share this information outside of OBM by saving the whole dashboard to a PDF file. Just click Menu and Print to PDF. You can also export individual chart values to CSV. Click the chart's title and in the menu click Export CSV. Lastly, you can click Real-Time in a chart to compare historical performance with real-time performance. This assumes the real-time feature has been enabled on the agent. To learn more about Performance Dashboard, see the OBM online help and search for Performance Perspective.